hey guys what's up welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are having a wonderful day if you're interested in this wig and how i styled it i'm gonna leave the link to that video right above and i'm just gonna clip my hair back real quick and then we can get started so first off i'm gonna take my urban decay eyeshadow primer potion and place it on my eyelids and blend it out with my finger then i'm going to take my la girl pro concealer in the color toffee and use that to lighten my eyelids to make my eyeshadow pop for this look blending that out with my damp and clean beauty blender and then next we're only going to be working from one eyeshadow palette today and that's the lorac pro eyeshadow palette the first one i'm going to take this color taupe and place that all over my eyelids using a fluffy brush and then I'm going to take that same brush into a deeper brown color and this is the color Sable. I'm going to use this color as my crease color and my outer V color. And what I like to do if I'm wearing makeup with glasses is to make a smoky eye that's not too dramatic and that has a bright lid color that pops through the lens of my glasses. So now I'm going to go into a deeper brown and this is the color Espresso with a denser, more defined brush to really smoke out my eyes. I don't want it too dark and too deep though because I'm wearing glasses and the frames of my glasses is going to overpower that. So I just want it smoky enough, if that makes sense. And then for my lid color, I chose the color Garnet in this palette. And I'm going to just spray some of my setting spray on the brush so that the eyeshadow can be more defined on my lids. And if you wear a simple look like this with glasses, it really balances the look out because the glasses is not overpowering the makeup and the makeup is not too complicated that you can't see all the details with it through the frames and through the glasses basically. Moving on to the face, I'm going to take my primer spray from City Color and I'm going to spray that all over my face and then pat that into my skin. And I'm going to take my primer potion and just place it on my smile lines so that they're not peeking through my foundation as usual. The foundation I'm going to use today is the Clinique Perfectly Real Makeup. And I actually haven't used this foundation in a while. It's actually a good color match for me. It's more of my winter color than my summer color. But fun fact is this is actually the first liquid foundation I've ever used. This is the second bottle I've had of this foundation, but the first time I ever used it was for prom. And I only went to my senior prom, my senior prom, and my date senior prom. And I went to the Clinique stand to get my makeup done. So I think that was like the first time I had a full face of makeup. And you know I had to add that little head itch in there because when your wig, when your hair is itching you and you're wearing a wig, let me tell you. I'm just using my LA Pro Girl Concealer and Toffee again to highlight my face. And I tried a new thing with putting it where your little mustache area is on your upper lip. Like what I see a lot of girls do. It was okay. I don't know if it's a technique I will always use. But it was okay. I'm just going to blend it out as usual. To set my entire face, I'm going to use my Fit Me Powder in the color Coconut number 355 I'm just patting that into my skin and then I'm gonna bronze up my face using my Nika K contour duo and I know you guys haven't seen this in a minute but yes I still use it I'm actually doing something different again with this and I'm just going to instead of contour my face bronze my face using a fluffier brush now I'm going to do this little trick where I'm going to kind of tight line my upper lash line and also rub it across the top of my upper lash line. I'm using this black pencil that I got from Sephora as a gift to purchase. And this is just to make the appearance of my eyelashes look a thicker because we're not going to be putting on false lashes today because I'm wearing glasses. This is my first time trying this mascara, guys. I was so hyped to try it. This is the collab with Maybelline and Makeup Shayla and Manny MUA. And I actually really like this mascara. It's come to join my top few mascaras. I'm kind of picky when it comes to mascara because not every mascara works on my lashes. But this is really good. And it doesn't like clump up or anything. Now for highlighter, I chose to keep it soft and subtle using Precious Petals from Wet n Wild. 
And I'm just spraying my brush with some setting spray before putting the highlighter on my face. I actually really like it. It's a really nice soft highlighter. To make my eyes appear larger and brighter and wider, I'm actually going to go in with a light color eyeliner in my waterline and that's the color Get Paid from ColourPop. And then a nice bright inner corner highlight and this is the gold eyeshadow from the Larac Pro Palette. And you really want that to open up your eyes when you're wearing glasses and it brings a lot of focus and attention to your eyes. I'm just lining my lips now with Max Chestnut and then using my favorite lipstick from this Jordana line, Molten Chocolate Cake. I'm going to place that on my lips today. And if you guys haven't seen my review yet and lip swatch video on these lipsticks, I'm going to leave the card for it right up above. Lastly, I'm going to spray my face with some setting spray. And then you're ready to put on your glasses. So yeah, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. This is how I wear makeup with glasses, a nice subtle smoky eye with a bright pop of color on the lids. Make sure to brighten up your eyes by using a nude or light eyeliner in your waterline and a nice pop of highlight in your inner eye to brighten your eyes as well through the lens of your glasses. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Share my video if you want to as well. And guys, I will see you in my next video. I love you and have a wonderful rest of your day. One of my favorite Christian songs, Oceans. Oh.